Delta V Mobile is a mobile application for iOS and Android devices that brings your operations data to your fingertips. In this video, we will walk through the mobile application to highlight its major capabilities. Download Delta V Mobile from the Apple App Store or Google Play Store. When you first launch the app, you are presented with a login screen. If you have a valid username, password, and Delta V Mobile server, then you can enter those details here to see your personalized watch lists and alarm lists. If this is your first time to log in, you might see a registration page, which is used to whitelist your mobile device against your username. An administrator will have to accept your request before you can continue. For now, we will launch into demo mode. Delta V Mobile presents your process data into personalized watch lists and alarm lists. From the All Lists tab, we can see both. The green flag icon is used to indicate custom notifications, which are discussed in another video. Tap on the Watch List tab to see the ones you are subscribed to. At first glance, we can see that the Boiler Watch List has 11 items. Two of these are an alarm, three of them have active custom notifications, and two more have an abnormal condition as indicated by the blue exclamation point. In the boiler watch list, we can see several process values listed with their description on the left and real-time value with units on the right. The blue spark lines present a live 20-minute trend. These watch lists get created using a web-based application called Delta V Mobile Studio. You can watch our other videos to see how easy it is to customize these lists for your individual users. Watch lists are used to track any parameter from Delta V or OPC that is of interest. It could be a pressure, level, flow, temperature, motor, valve, or even bypass and diagnostics. Simply put, if it's a parameter in Delta V or OPC, then you can put it on a watch list. By tapping on one of these items in the watch list, we can see even more details, including a 1 to 24 hour trend. Notice that for this PID loop, we are tracking PV, set point, and output. Delta V Mobile's native integration with Delta V automatically brings in the scale, units, mode, and description. And we can even see when we have something like abnormal mode. Tap and hold your finger over the trend window to use the sliding bumper to view the process values at a given point in time. You can change the time scale using the tabs above the trend. And you can also change the y-axis scaling by tapping on the parameter, such as output to make it 0 to 100. If you want to share this view with a colleague, you can collaborate by sending this over text or email. If your colleague has Delta V Mobile, then they can open to this page of the app directly with the link. You can also subscribe to alarm lists, which are a subset of alarms from your Delta V system. These alarm lists can be filtered by area, priority, category, or functional classification. At first glance, we can quickly see which alarm lists have active, inactive, or suppressed alarms. The colored icons tell you what is the highest priority within the alarm list. The GMP alarm list has one inactive alarm. Commonly, you will interface with alarm lists by receiving a notification. Notifications can be configured in Delta V Mobile Studio for each user independently, with customizable delays and reminders. Delta V Mobile can send you SMS, email, or push notifications. With a push notification, you can tap it to open a deep link into the application. This takes you directly to the associated alarm list. In this view, you will notice colors and shapes which indicate various priorities of alarms in Delta V. Red circles are critical, yellow triangles are warning, and purple upside down triangles are advisory. The check mark indicates that the operator in Delta V has acknowledged this alarm. And if you notice grayed out colors, these indicate inactive alarms. The Suppress tab allows us to view both shelved alarms and out-of-service alarms. If we tap on the first alarm, 
We can get even more details, including the time in, functional classification, which is equipment protection, and we also have an interactive trend to see what the live process value is doing in relation to the alarm threshold. If you notice below the trend, we have also automatically integrated Delta V Alarm Help, which can be configured to show time to respond, consequence of inaction, and recommended action. This is a very handy tool for sharing alarm response procedures between operators. The Claim Alarm button is related to alarm escalation. If you tap this button, then your username is presented on this alarm page for other users to see, and the alarm notification will be stopped for this alarm. Learn more about this feature by watching our other video.